Hi everyone. So on my page, I talk a lot about regulating the nervous system and I talk about using somatic practices. Soma means body. Um, and what I've come to learn and experience myself over the years is the importance of using physiology. So getting into our body to bring regulation, to bring calm, to bring us out of a sympathetic, fight or flight mode into more of a parasympathetic rest and digest mode of our nervous system. And I'm actually uh, teaching a workshop um, on this Sunday, October 8th from 4 to 530. Uh, this is for my Long Island friends. It's, uh, it's going to be an in-person workshop at the beautiful Nest store in Northport, New York. And I wanted to show you an example of the kinds of things that I will be teaching on Sunday. So you can see firsthand what I mean by somatic practices. And one uh, technique that I absolutely love is something called havening. And just like, you know, the word haven, which means to feel safe, um, that's what havening does. It helps us feel safe. Um, so one thing that, and how it works is, um, it uses touch and it helps mitigate feelings of stress. And it actually, um, there's actual science behind this. It actually sh helps to shift our brain in the present moment. And it actually can help put our brain into a delta wave state. And delta is something we usually um, uh, are in when we're sleeping, but experienced meditators will tell you that they are able to get into a delta state um, when they're awake. So this is, this is another way to generate some feelings of delta. Um, or the feelings that you get from Delta. And another thing that it's doing is it's actually activating our happy chemicals. Um, it can activate oxytocin, serotonin, and dopamine. And it actually reduces our stress hormones of cortisol and norepinephrine. Um, so I wanted to go ahead, and now that I told you a little bit about it, I wanted to demonstrate what havening looks like and how you can uh, do it at home. So the first uh, way to haven is actually by putting our hands on our shoulders and bringing them down to our elbows. Oh my gosh, there's a bee. <laughs> Hopefully the bee won't sting me while I'm doing this. Um, so basically we're giving ourselves a nice warm hug. And while you're doing this, another thing you can add to it is you could actually either think or say out loud an affirmation. So you could say something like, I am safe. I am safe. Hopefully I am safe from the little bee flying around. Oh my gosh. Um, another way to haven is by taking our hands and touching our eyebrows and going down our cheeks. I really like this one a lot. I think this could also be good if you're feeling like a tension headache. Ah. And then another way to haven is by using our hands, by rubbing them together. And while you're doing this, don't forget to breathe. And something else you could do is, well, what about your eyes? You know, how can we bring the eyes in? So you could Close your eyes if that feels good. Or you could keep your eyes open and you could uh, rest your eyes on a soft gaze. So you just gaze for a minute. That feels nice too. And what's great about Havening too is it's portable. You don't need any fancy gadgets. It's something you could do in the moment. You know, you could, even, you could do it in your car. You could do it, um, you know, anywhere you could think of. It's extremely portable. And while you're doing it too, I want you to notice how you feel how, or how your body is feeling before you do it, while you're doing it, and after. Because you want to see if you observe any shifts in your state. You know, if you were feeling anxious and you did this, did it stop ruminating thoughts for you? Did it, um, if you were maybe a little shaky, are you less shaky now? Were you clenching something before and maybe now whatever you were clenching is nice and loose? Um, so those, it's just always good to notice 
if we practice noticing what's going on in our body and our nervous system, then we can be aware of dysregulation or tightness or clenching or cramping, and then we can address it. So that is havening. And I'm curious, I'd love to hear from you. Um, is this a technique you've tried before? Um, and does it resonate with you? Um, or if you go ahead and do it after you watch this video, um, how did it make you feel? What did you notice in your body? And you know, how you feel while you're doing it, um, you know, in the exact, you know, the first time or in the moment, um, could feel, you know, it could feel di different uh, later in the day. It could feel different tomorrow. It could feel different a year from now. Um, so, and there's no right or wrong um, way to feel. It's just noticing um, how it makes you feel and your body feel and your nervous system. So with that, thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.